Pakistan's journey to the stars began over seven decades ago with dreams that seem far beyond reach. Today, despite the challenges, those dreams are closer to reality, driven by passion, persistence, and a new era of international collaboration. The seeds of Pakistan's space program were sown in the 1950s, just a few years after the country's independence. With limited resources and minimal international support, a small group of visionaries at the University of Karachi laid the foundation for what would become the nation's astronomical pursuits. I personally feel that any country, Pakistan or any other country, and I'm talking of developing countries in particular, if we do not partake of the activities in a space science, we cannot survive in future. The times are very different now. In the early years, Pakistan's space program faced many hurdles, limited funding, political instability, and a lack of expertise. But those who persisted were driven by a belief that space exploration was vital for the country's future. To be very true, at the larger scale uh, that any country has of space program, Karachi University's contribution is that uh, uh, the first uh, astronomical observatory was established in Karachi University way back in 1968. And uh, amongst uh, the University of uh, Pakistan, it was only Karachi University that was uh, teaching astronomy. Uh, lots of students like me uh, studied astronomy from there. The dawn of the 21st century brought new opportunities. The long-standing friendship between Pakistan and China evolved into a strategic partnership in space exploration. The China-Pakistan Economic Corridor not only strengthened economic ties, but also paved the way for collaboration in space missions. I think China has already done a lot, and we are very thankful. And uh, I would like to share one thing that in this small era of 2018 to 2024, we at ND are become a part of a BRIA, Belt and Road Initi Aerospace Initiative. And obviously this is all because of the China. I think we can do a lot mutually in different aspects. For example, when we can start from the student exchange program in the respective, the faculty exchange, joint research projects, these collaborations are not just about the exchange of technology. They are about building a future where Pakistan plays a pivotal role in the exploration of space. In recent years, Pakistan's space ambitions have taken another leap forward with its involvement in China's Chang'e 6 mission. This mission, which included a Pakistani payload, marked a significant milestone in Pakistan's space program symbolizing its growing capabilities and international standing. The recent IQQ mission, a joint project between Pakistani and Chinese students, is an example of what can be achieved when nations come together. For the first time in history, a Pakistani satellite orbited the moon as part of China's Chang'e 6 mission. The mission, which aimed to explore the moon's far side, employed lunar research payloads from several countries, including Pakistan's IQ Commerce Satellite. Today, a new generation of Pakistani space scientists is emerging. Inspired by the successes of the past and the opportunities of the present, these young minds are ready to push the boundaries of what's possible. As a kid, I used to watch a show in television on cosmology. And from there, I came to know that 
we are part of a solar system and there are around billion of stars like us, like us in our galaxy that makes one galaxy and there are about trillion of galaxies in our entire universe and at that time I a question popped in my head that our university is so vast and far beyond our imagination so why earth is the only planet that sustain life that have life in it and that truly inspired me to uh, pursue this field and become an astronomer and a space scientist. The success of the Chang'e 6 mission has inspired a new generation of scientists and engineers in Pakistan. For students like Abir, the experience has been transformative. It is my dream to see Pakistan having its own space launching pad. In this such scenario, I will try my best to make Pakistan produce or develop its own uh, space uh, launching pad where we can send our own spacecraft from our own land. Abir's dream is to one day work alongside Chinese space scientists. China has sent us an opportunity and uh, given us a scenario where we, ha we can collaborate with them in many ways and learn about new technologies, uh, advanced tools uh, regarding space research programs. They are also giving us many opportunities and offering many scholarships where students like me can go and study in an advanced environment. Abir's journey reflects the aspirations of many Pakistani students who see the universe as their laboratory, where they can explore the unknown and contribute to the global body of knowledge. little girl, the sky always fascinates me and I always want to know what is behind the uh, blue layers. Uh, after my FSC degree, I choose this field and now I am here. And uh, uh, as a uh, little girl, we always hear old poems stating stars, moons and twinkle twinkle little stars. Uh, and always inspire me to, to this and now I am. Zoha's story is one of determination and resilience. As a woman in a traditionally male-dominated field, she has faced her share of challenges. Yet, her passion for space and belief in her abilities have driven her to excel. Aspirations and dreams has no limits. So I, have, so I dream uh, to be a part of any astronomical research in uh, international level, developing new techniques and be the front person in new generations of space explorers. For students like Abir and Zoha, the IQQ mission was more than just a project. It was a dream come true. This mission was a stepping stone for Pakistan's youth to gain hands-on experience in space science, working alongside international peers to design and launch a satellite into space. The future of Pakistan's space program holds immense potential. With the continued support of international allies like China and the passion of its young scientists, Pakistan is poised to make significant contributions to global space exploration. Chang'e 6 mission is, I guess, is, is, is very impressive. It demonstrates the technical uh, advancements in field of space science, especially uh, in, in particularly the missions that are related to uh, lunar sample collection. So I think it's very impressive the high um, level of expertise and the innovations that China has shown to the world, a uh, way to inspire others to progress their space programs. The University of Karachi has been at the forefront of space education in Pakistan. The aim is to produce quality students who will lead Pakistan's space program into the future. Space science is a very wider field, so we are offering a specialization uh, in, you know, astronomy, aerospace science, atmospheric physics, remote sensing, and GIS. So, you know, the main purpose is, you know, to produce a quality student for the space science program of Pakistan. As Pakistan's space program continues to grow, the focus is increasing on nurturing the next generation of space scientists and engineers. With institutions like NED University and the University of Karachi leading the way, 
students are being equipped with the skills and knowledge they need to push the boundaries of what is possible. But there is still room for improvement. As a developing country, the universities are not well equipped. The government of Pakistan uh, have to take uh, uh, more seriously uh, our space program uh, by uh, offering uh, uh, different opportunities uh, and uh, by providing platforms to students and uh, uh, researchers and professionals as well. Uh, and also they have to uh, focus mainly on the space education uh, program so that uh, uh, our space uh, 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 mission uh, uh, will be alive and uh, we can compete uh, with other countries in space technology. From humble beginnings to the vastness of space, Pakistan's journey is far from over. As the country continues to dream big, the universe is theirs to explore. With the strength of partnership and the passion of its people, Pakistan is truly reaching for the stars. And as Pakistan continues its journey to the stars, it is the dreams and aspirations of young minds like Abir and Zoha that will propel the nation forward. Together, they are shaping a future where the sky is not the limit, but just the beginning. For Simon Asia, I'm Daniel Khan in Karachi, Southeast Pakistan.